You are now watching Kingdom Work TV. Welcome to Life of a Dreamer. This is Dream 2 that I had back in June. Actually, June 17th. That's what I had. And I woke up at 6 49 a.m. I had a dog in my dream, and the dog was all white. It was a group of people, and they were mad at me and my dog for no reason. I told my dog to come here, and I remember it was snow on the ground but it was all melting. My dog came to me and I noticed my dog needed a bath and a haircut. This group of people was mad at my dog because he intimidated another dog. And my dog came to me and went upstairs to our apartment. Clearly, I don't own an apartment. You know what I'm saying? I do live in a house, but I don't own an apartment. And this is an interpretation that I got. A white dog meeting. When a white dog appears in a dream, it means the need for protection against negative influence or energies in our lives. In the snow, refreshment, that's best what it means, refreshment. So, at the time, I'm like negative energy, negative, uh, uh, like, but God was warning me about what's is going to happen in the future or what just transpired between me and my friends. I'm the white dog and I'm intimidating them because the things how God is moving in my life, how God is actually cleaning me up, the white snow. I just needed a haircut. God sitting there cleaning me up and I'm intimidating my friends that's around me. And I ain't even do anything about it. And that began the separation between me and my friends because a lot of events began to happen between us. You know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of things I wasn't, I, I didn't agree with anymore. You know what I'm saying? Because not because of a lifestyle that they was living, it's because the direction where God is taking me. And that everybody, you know what I'm saying, don't recognize that, they don't understand that. And especially if they're not rebuilding or walking with Christ themselves. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes, I ain't gonna lie, for the most part, people aren't gonna understand what God has for you, no matter in the body of Christ or not. They not gonna understand what God has for you. And my friends at the time did not understand the plans and the will of God over my life. And because of that reason right there, begin a separation.